Welcome to Devices Setup channel and today we will learn how to set up TP-Link AX3000, RE715X and AX5400, RE815X Wi-Fi extender setup. So to start the setup, first plug the extender in the same room as the router and then wait for its power LED to get stable. Now there are three methods to set up the extender. First is via WPS, second via app and third is via browser. So let's learn the WPS method first. In this, you will have to press the WPS button on the extender for around two seconds. Then within two minutes, press the WPS button on the router. You can check the video in the description if you can't find the WPS on the router. Now within 60 seconds, the extender will get connected to the router. The solid WPS light on the extender confirms a successful setup and if you don't have a solid internet light on the extender then it could be possible that the WPS is disabled on the router watch our video on how to enable the WPS on the router now let's learn the second method that is set up via the tether app for this first you will need to download the tether app for your android or ios device the link to download the app is given in the description make sure your extender is plugged into a power source and have a solid power led now once you have downloaded and installed the app open the app and log in into the app using the tp-link id and password and if you already don't have a tp-link account then you can create one next select the range extender as your device that you want to add after this, the app will ask for your permission to join TP-Link extender network name. You will then have to create a login password for this extender. Then it will ask you to select your network name that you want to extend and type its password for verification. And if your router is a dual band router, then select the 5 GHz network and type its password again. Next, follow the on-screen instructions to complete the setup. Now for the third method too, make sure the extender is plugged into a power outlet near your router with power LED on. Next, use your phone or computer and connect to the TP-Link extender network showing up in your Wi-Fi list. Once connected, open a browser on the same device and into the URL type tplinkrepeater.net and hit search or enter. This will take you to the extender's login page. And if it don't, then type 192.168.0.254 into the URL to access the setup page on the setup page follow the on-screen instructions to complete the setup here it will ask you to select the network name that you want to extend and then type its password for verification after the setup is complete the extended network will show up in the wi-fi list with underscore ext suffix after your home network name and in case if you have enabled the one mesh feature on the extender and you have one mesh compatible router then the tp-link extender ssid will be same as the router plus the password is also same as the router's wi-fi password so this is how you can set up tp-link re715x and re815x wi-fi extenders and if you found this video useful then do kindly give this video a thumbs up plus please do subscribe to the channel this will immensely help my channel so see you beautiful people in the next video until then have a blessed day